Hello fellow content creators and social media managers, welcome to another YouTube video and in this video I am going to be sharing with you some of my favorite Google tools that I have been using and these tools have helped me to stay organized, collaborate efficiently with other creators and also work, effect work effectively with my clients. It has also helped me streamline my workflow process. So let's dive right into it. Before I go on, if you're new to this channel, my name is Balaji. I am a content creator slash social media mentor. I help everyone who is trying to start a career in social media management. I also have a community of over 7,000 members that help each other day to day, day in, day out. And everybody is welcome. If you want to join, it's free. The link is in the description below and it is on Telegram. First up, we have Google Drive. This iCloud story solution has been a game changer for me i can store and assess all my files my vid my images my videos and documents in one centralized location i also made sure to buy space like i have 100 gig as you can see here so you can buy space i think it cost me like 3500 naira i don't know how much it cost in dollar but that's how much i bought it in naira so i mean i pay for the entire year so i have enough space with a seamless integration with other devices i can always work on any project anytime i can connect to it on my ipad i can connect to it on my phone i can connect to it on my laptop so i don't have to be in one place at a particular time if i'm connecting to it so i really love using google drive and it is one of my favorite google products next up we have google keep and i use google keep to plan my youtube and my podcast scripts like this note taking app is perfect for like jotting down your ideas if you want to create to do list you can create to do list with it it's also very good to capture inspiration on the go like Google Keep is it syncs with all the other devices. So I can assess if I'm assessing Google Keep on my iPad currently, it's the same thing it will be showing me on my laptop if once it is updated. So I really, really love using Google Keep a lot, especially when it comes to planning out my YouTube script, my my ebooks and my um my podcast scripts basically so i love it and i use it mainly for that next up is google sheets i use google sheets to create my content calendars a whole lot i also use it to like keep records i use it to keep records of people in my community i use it to keep records of people that fill my google forms like just to keep records but i use it mainly to create calendars you can use google sheets to create dynamic spreadsheets to monitor engagement you can use it to track followers um, followers growth you can use it to to track analytics like track your analytics but that's not what i use it for there are so many people that use google um, sheets to track the analytics but it's not what i use it for mostly use it for google calendar and i love it a lot but i am literally moving towards notion but we'll talk about that later on the fourth one is google calendar like i really love the way google calendar syncs with a whole lot of applications so for example i use calendly to manage my bookings so when someone books a meeting for me through calendly a meeting with me through calendly what it does is it sets up um my zoom is also connected to my calendly so it sets up a meeting gives them the zoom id and syncs automatically with my google calendar so i i don't have to do it manually i love that's one of the favorite things about google calendar that i love so i use it basically to plan my entire day i you can see on somewhere on the screen here that i'm showing you like i have different color codes when it comes to like using google calendar and it is one of my favorite google tools you can use it to plan your virtual meetings your clients calls your team collaborations and it has a lot of features and there is literally no app that doesn't like sync with your google calendar right now so it is one of my favorite tools and i feel like a lot of social media managers and content creators are sleeping on google calendar you can you can literally even change the x code the color code and generate your own code if you're like someone that is very very how will i say it aesthetically pleasing <laughs> like if you just like you you're so um how will i say it you're uh i'm lost i'm, I'm short of words but you get it right <laughs> lastly google meet now google meets communication is key in social media management and content creation so you can use google meet as a content creator or a social media manager you, it's free but one of the drawbacks i don't like is the fact that you can't record if you don't have like a business email with gmail but it's quickly it's, you can quickly set that up but it doesn't just work for me basically but i use google meet and i also use zoom accordingly so you can use them and i like the way it also like syncs across all devices so you can like literally check it out it's free 
it's free it's created by google owned by google and a lot of people use google Mint. and there you go this google tools have become my trusted allies when it comes to content creation social media management or social media marketing i hope you found this video helpful if you did please don't forget to like this video don't forget to leave me a comment i like to hear from you which ones do you use and which one is kind of like your favorite i am mostly joined to google drive because it's literally like the best <laughs> so i mostly joined to google drive because i always want to like store something there is no single day i am not downloading something that i need to save or i need to store so let me know which one is your favorite google tool and if you please don't forget to subscribe turn on the notification bell subscribe 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 and i see you guys in my next video